Time now for number six, and for that we go to Toronto FC's midfield star playmaker, Victor Vasquez. Only played for two seasons, but boy oh boy, what are two seasons he had, and I think it impacts everything. He's number six. Some people had him number two on their list, yeah. not quite number one. We had him very high as well. Um, not sure where to start here. All around wonderful guy. Saw, the, saw a football field probably unlike any other player on this list who's ever played in Canada. Yeah, I'd say one of the most talented football players that ever played in Canada. Yeah. That is a big statement, isn't it? But we went through a, a list of some wonderful names, but just a guy with, with incredible vision. I used to call games with this lad when, when he played at Toronto KJ, and I can't remember him doing a thing wrong. Right. You know, like I, I can't remember him making the wrong decision. When you're sitting up high, it's easy to be critical and think, well, that pass was there. And he always chose the right option. Yeah. He always played the pass at the right time. He was never indulgent for himself with touches or moments. Like I said, uh, just a, a magnificent football player. And tough as well. Yeah. Tough, yeah. true winning mentality. That's coming up a lot on this list. If you're young players out there, you've got to understand talent will only get you so far. The winning mentality obviously breeded at La Masia in Barcelona, that yep. winning culture that he had, that he brought to Toronto FC. We talked earlier on our list about Chris Mavinga was a big piece in coming over from the difference between 16 and 17. The biggest piece, the difference maker was Victor Vasquez that led them to the cup and a fitting goal scorer to make sure they won it. Fitting goal scorer, it was a great moment. I know it came really easily for him, but he, he absolutely deserved it because of his impact on that side. And he was a missing piece, wasn't he, from the season before where there was heartache against Seattle and, and MLS Cup. Vasquez brought that missing piece, that, that, that killer ability to find the right pass at the right time. And uh, yeah, someone that was brilliant and you mentioned that KJ you know grit comes in many different forms yeah. this lad would play through injuries he would he would do what was right for the team in many different uh, occasions he'd play different positions he played almost like a striker at times when they yeah. needed him as well so uh you know, a real team player and someone who, who just wanted the best, wanted to win and wanted the best for his team. A great personality, a fantastic teammate. Nobody's got one bad word to say no. about him. Nobody who, who, in Toronto. <laughs> not one bad, yeah. not bad word. And finally, the other playoff game he scored at, I think, deserves recognition in New York against the Red Bulls, eight minutes into the game. That was a tough tie. I never forget Sebastian Javinko telling me that was one of the toughest games yeah. he's ever played against. It could have gone either way, and he got that goal early that helped really settle the nerves. In the end, it was very close as well. It went on a way goal, so yeah. it was a massive goal, but a huge goal for Victor Vasquez as well. And he comes in in our list at number six, and we thank him for the memories. Welcome to the best list brought to you by Best Athletes, helping youth soccer players develop and get recruited and helping coaches build better athletes and teams.